welcome to a little Minecraft tutorial here. So I set this all up. So like, I set it up a really long time ago. So like, we could like, instead of just doing a whole tutorial, like going through a whole world, I decided like to just set up some chests to introduce some stuff in creative and survival mode to make it a lot easier. So then, so then in the next video, we could actually start like a new survival world and not having to like explain that much stuff. So let's get started here. So um, as you hear, I'm, I'm, I'm holding an iron sword, which does, if you wanna look at the attack damage, it does six attack damage. And then the pickaxe is usually for mining. So if we can just go right here. So let's just dig down a little bit. Just never dig straight down because you'll hit lava eventually. See, but if I try to break the stone with my hand, it'll take forever and plus it will not work. So, so let's get started here. So what's in this first chest, we call these spawn eggs. You could, you could literally only find these in creative mode or if you dig deep, deep down enough, you could find like spawners, but they're not spawn eggs. So you can only find these in creative mode. These are not all the spawn eggs, but I just enough to fit inside this chest. I don't know why I didn't put one more. So let's just introduce some of the mobs here. And um, all right, so this is a villager, and if I and if I click on him, there's a trade, and he's a farmer villager. And if you trade an emerald, you get four pieces of bread. But some of the trades are not good, so I wouldn't recommend using all the trades all the time, but we might try trading later, so I'm just gonna put them in a hole. Come here. <laughs> Get in the hole. Get in the hole. So, and then there's a um, mushroom, let's call it mushroom. All right, like, it's the same thing as cows. I think it drops the mushrooms on its back sometimes. And then there's a donkey plenty more of those spider which is actually one of the biggest mobs and oh my god that is rare all right that, that is pretty rare to happen i don't i didn't i didn't mean for that to happen so i think that was a skeleton do i have it i think i might just not nah, to showcase the skeleton here but there's a spider there i mean that's very rare to find a skeleton on a spider in the skeleton and you can see they do burn but if they have armor on they will not burn so if you're asking like why don't sell and here's the zombie pigment. It actually will attack you only if you hit it. Look. Come here. See it's kind of similar to the wolf. And it does do a lot of damage because this is pretty rare for it to drop its golden sword. So like and then there's a little baby silverfish. Alright, that is pretty annoying. You know, this is this might take a while, so let's just move on to the next chest. I'll just put these spawn eggs back. Because we're gonna have to have a lot of stuff. Don't mind all this, some of the stuff in my inventory, because we will we'll be showcasing that later. And then we have ores. Now, the ores are basically, you could smelt them. But, all right, let's talk, some ores you could not smelt. So, gold ore, you could smelt. Like, so, how to smelt, you have to get coal, you don't have to get 64. Just at least one piece of gold, coal to smelt it. Also, you will have to smelt iron, but, like, Besides gold and iron, all of this other stuff you could you could just mine. So let's just take all this other stuff and then let's just mine it. See, and then it will drop its item. But some of it gives more than its item. Like um, the lapis ore, it gives you five, and then the redstone ore gives you five. And then the lapis, you could really only make lapis blocks out of it, so I don't get the whole point of lapis. All right, the gold should, should be done. Yeah, so that's the same thing as the zombie job, zombie pigment. So now we're gonna smoke the iron. So we have gold. The one of the rarest things is diamonds and emeralds. Those are like the rarest thing. And diamonds are like you can make diamond armor out of it. You can make all kinds of stuff. So once this is done smelting, we should move on. We're gonna move on to the next chest here. Yeah, so it is done smelting. So this is an iron ingot. We will get to that right now. And here we have everything like that you need to survive. We have the iron sword, the iron pickaxe, the shovel, the axe, and the hoe, which we need to show off. 
And sticks, you could craft them by hitting a tree and then just put putting two oak planks together. So let's say if we just come over here. So that, what the axe is for, it could be, you could, you could use it for a weapon. But you only need one piece of wood. Look, you could just craft it and then you could just automatically make eight sticks out of that. That is actually pretty easy to craft. And you don't have to have it on cra classic crafting. I always get my word mixed up. And then the hoe is for the, um, you can farm, but I don't get the whole point of farming. I mean, you can make some food. I mean, if you break this, sometimes it'll give you wheat seeds. And then you can farm. But that, that'll, pro that'll take a little while. So let's just, um, let's not do that. So moving on to the next, do we not? Oh, shovels. Shovels are just, you know, for digging <coughs> only the grass. Here, let's just showcase it. Why not? Why not? So we're gonna be, um, we're gonna be going over here, and there is actually a cheap. So now we have the gold and apples. Actually, I'm gonna show real quick just how to craft a gold and apple. So is it? Our right, have cheats on to go with this. So. Real quick, I'm gonna show you guys how to craft a golden apple. All right, so if we go here, and then put this in, and there's an enchanted golden apple. And then you just use it for gold ingots for the other apple. So, um, what did I do? I don't know, is it even in the chest? Oh, it is. And then in the next chest, we just have, so this might be the dangerous mob ever, so we might have to move far away to do this. I don't know if it will work because I will, I was having glitches. I might have to showcase it in another episode. You know what? Yeah, let's save that for another episode because this has to be one of the hardest mobs to kill and I don't have the materials. And now we have the end portal, which it doesn't work sometimes. I'll show you guys it on one world that I built in survival in the next episode. It wasn't a whole world, but it was like a <coughs> the world and I built a big world. I didn't build the whole world in survival. I built part of it in creative. And this is the end portal. So we're just gonna um this might take a little while but this is what happens when you craft the end portal. You can only craft it in creative. We're not gonna fight it now. We're not gonna go there now. We're gonna go there in another episode. So in this chest there's just bow and arrow of course. So you could just Fling the bow, fling the arrow, and then the diamonds and emeralds. And then we have all kinds of food. Now, the, there's something different about the cake. You can't eat the cake regularly. So what happens if, oh my god, I put the cake down. I put the cake down. I put the cake, I can't eat it now. I put it down. Well, no, all you gotta do is just eat it how you eat regular food. Just, just do that. Don't break it. And then in this final chest, we're gonna show off the golems. We're gonna show off the first, the strongest golem of all golems, the iron golem. So we're gonna go, come on, go over here. Before we show off the other golem. So the iron golem, you need to craft four blocks of iron and then just put a head on it and then there we go. It doesn't show it, but it does have a hundred health. Wait, hold on, before we do anything, we're about to make this trade. So it is kind of a bad trade and then you so, you'll see it starts bubbling because there will be a new trade after like, I don't know. And there will be a new trade, probably like a, you'll leave and then there will be a new trade. So we'll check out that later in the next episode or if, or if it's done by, by this episode, we will check it out. So we're gonna look here mm -hmm. in the snow golem. I will, and I'm gonna just throw some snowballs for fun. This is. This is like the, you could just throw it and it's kind of fun. Like, you just hit sheep. And I don't know how they like die. Like, it's, it's gonna die and it's gonna turn into war or something. So, or I don't know, is it eventually gonna die? Anyways, so let's not, we're gonna try that out in another episode or something. There are a lot of things. All right, so this is a snowball. And if 
it moves around, it will it will make snow. Why won't it move? Can you move, sir? Move. I don't know why it, it won't move. So I'm gonna check out the villager. Why didn't you make a new trade? You you villagers always have to ruin everything for me. And why won't you move? Where'd the iron golem even go? Well, you see like these things, like the humans and the golems, they like move. Like the villagers, they move like literally anywhere. Like it's like I don't know, they like go anywhere. Like right now, see, look, I think it just happened. You see, the snow golem just drops snow sometimes, it doesn't all the time. And if you want to actually get the snow, you can turn it, it'll turn into snowball just with the shovel. So if you want snowball, that's an easy way of getting snowballs. You know, there is a snow bottom over there. And don't ask me how to fly because I'm just using cheats right now. You shouldn't really use cheats for survival world because it's not survival. So just get many snowballs for that. And then I think, did we miss something? I remember this was a long time ago, so. And this is not updated, so it's like, I don't know. But it's the same thing. It just doesn't have like some of the new mobs and features. I could show those on the Xbox One. Yeah, I have it for the Xbox One. I could show those on the Xbox One, like the um, Elder Guardian and all those stuff. Guardian. I could show those on another thing, on another tutorial, but you know, we just might make a survival world, or I might show you my main world. A survival world or my main world in the next episode. I'll decide on it. So, so guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe and like this video. No, let's aim 10 likes. Just 10. Guys, please 10 likes for this video. And I and I will and whatever you guys want me to do, I will do in the next video. My main world, which is a surprise and, or a regular survival world. So let's aim for 10 likes and I'll be doing another video. So guys, I hope you enjoyed. Hope you enjoyed, guys. Bye.